What's up going on everybody? This is Mario from the Super Society YouTube and well We just got shown off a lot of games at the Xbox press conference at E3 here and well And this is just a nice little recap video on what we heard and my thoughts about it as well Starting off with the first game they showed off Halo Infinite Master Chief is back He's back on a new engine. The old art style has returned, but still this is like the make it or break it now for Halo. This is the biggest test of 343's career to bring back Halo, to bring it back big. It's come down to here. And while I'm, I'm, I can't wait for the game, I'm also scared for the game. Because if it fails, what can we say? It'll be over. It'll be, I mean, I'll still be getting Halos that come out because I'm, I'm too big of a Halo fan. I love Halo so much and I'm hoping they can come through with it. Halo Infinite, this is it, make it or break it. Gears of War came back with Gears 5, okay, Gears of War. I love the thing Gears of War did with the Gears Pop. That was the biggest troll ever. They went from Gears Pop to Gears Tactics, and then Gears 5. That was hilarious, people were probably like, no, where's Gears 5, where's Gears 5, and boom. You get Gears 5, but it was at the very end. That was pretty funny. Taking up the female protagonist, um, just picking up where the game started. It looks pretty good. Not much else to it. Just It was just a trailer, regular trailer, no real gameplay. Besides just some of it in the trailer of the ending. But, Gears of War, Gears 5. We'll have to wait until more news. Forza Horizon 4. I'm hype. You know, I love racing games. I love racing games, especially the arcade racer. Uh... My favorite being the Burnout series. I love the Burnout series. You know, I, I'm always sad because I just there's not enough racers out here. Racing is just not that popular uh, to most people. But looking at her at Forza Horizon 4, I'm hoping, you know, I might end up getting it just because I love racing games. They're good. I'm glad Microsoft hasn't given up on them. Just don't kill it. Don't kill the race. Don't, don't let it suck. You know, EA is just, they're doing me for speed dirty on how they're treating their game. Please. Forza Horizon 4 needs to be a great game to keep the racing genre alive, or at least the arcade racer alive. Fallout 76, now Bethesda's press conference will probably be out by the time this video comes out, but uh, we just saw a trailer. Can I'm not going to say too much about 76 because we don't really know anything. It was just another regular trailer, nice little teaser until Bethesda's press conference, and um, you can definitely see the multiplayer. You know, you, you, you're you leaving the vault, maybe more people are coming out of the vault, blah, 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 blah. You gotta rebuild. Most likely just rebuilding. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not gonna talk too much about 76 because there's still not enough information on it. So, I'm hyped for it. I can't wait to see it. Well, Dying Light 2 was a... Dying Light 2 was pretty... I was surprised to see it. I didn't even know Dying Light was that popular. I didn't play Dying Light 1. Um, besides the movement, I love the movement. I was with it. The parkour is amazing. At night, your zombie game. I'm not too big into zombie games now. Hey, Joe, you wanna play a zombie game though? But, you know... Uh, I'm cool. I'm glad Dying Light 1 did good. That they're coming out with Dying Light 2. It's cool. The Division 2. Okay. This is a big one because, God, The Division. Uh, They're really going for the second one, huh? I mean, I know there's... Um, I hear a lot. I heard a lot of cheers in the crowd for, Oh, yeah, Division! Woo! But, I don't know. Most people I meet that meet up with The Division. The Division was just not good. Well, I mean, not good. It was garbage. I don't know. Uh, They're coming out with the second one. <laughs> we'll have to see how that goes. Devil May Cry 5, DMC is back. That's a great one right there. I love Devil May Cry. Don Our boy Dante has returned. Game's gonna be awesome. I'm 100% sure of it. Seeing a new DMC after so long. What can you fuck up? I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a good game. It's gonna be a fun game. One game that's got the whole entire world's weight on its back right now. Cyberpunk 2077. This game's got too much hype. It's got a ton of hype. So... CG Project Red needs to really deliver with Pro Cyberpunk 2077. The trailer was amazing. Hyper got me going. I was hype. I was going crazy. I was like, God, I need this game now. I want to. I want to see this game in action. So when this game releases, yo, it's gonna be hard. It's gonna be hard because they can't mess it up. They cannot mess it up. There's too much hype for this game. Too much hype that they just you're not allowed to mess it up. Sure, they got a ton of ton of talented people. Like, did you see? Did you see those effects? Did you see the world? I believe in them. They're gonna get it right. They're gonna get it right. Cyberpunk 2077. Hype game. Hype game. Crackdown 3. Crackdown 3. Come on, Terry Crews carried that game. It's got, it's got my attention now. You got Terry Crews with it. I love Terry Crews. Funny dude. Um, Crackdown 3. I never played first or second Crackdown, like I said. 
looks it looks okay i'm sure the community that follows crackdown is gonna enjoy it um we'll have to see actual real gameplay uh that trailer was really good though it was awesome terry cruz killed it like as he always does come on now but hey crackdown 3 cuphead yes cuphead dlc for cuphead thank you for not stopping development on the game thank you for bringing new things to the game cuphead is an amazing game i loved it i played it on the channel um it's getting new playable character, new enemies, new bosses. This is awesome. We get to go back to Cuphead, everybody. We get to go back to Cuphead and rage some more. So I'm happy. I'm super happy. Welcome back, Cuphead. Welcome back. We're about to be seeing you all over the, all over YouTube and all over Twitch again. Battle Toads. Welcome back, Battle Toads. Uh, Mexican runner. I know. I'm sure he's uh really really excited because that dude loves speed running that game and he's the best speed runner for Battle Toads. So Battle Toads is back. Didn't see anything, it was just, hey, they're back. So, not really much I can say about that. Uh, what else, what else? Jump Force! Jump Force, a nice little anime fighting game for all the weeaboos out there. And no, I'm just gonna, there's another fighting game in, in the, in the works now. I'm sure, it'll, I'm sure it'll be cool. Naruto Dragon Ball One Piece and Death Note crossover. So, anime fighting game. If you love anime, yeah, I'm sure you're gonna be looking at this game. Just Cause 4, I am glad to see Just Cause 4. It's crazy. I never knew Just Cause would make it this far. I thought it was just one of those average games. But they, you got a community. You got a fourth game coming out. It's a crazy game. Just Cause lets you do so much things. So many things. And the game's insane. On which, you know, the, the level of freedom you get in the game, it's insane. It's a hype game. And it's a game that just goes balls deep. They don't care. They're going crazy. They're going crazy with it. Just cause four, excited for it. But my King Kingdom Hearts three though, okay, Kingdom Hearts three. Obviously, we're all hyped for it. Most of us are hyped for it. I'm hoping you're hyped for it. Xbox gets it. That's awesome. Congratulations to Xbox because you get to experience Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts is my childhood game. PlayStation two days. Oh man, Kingdom Hearts one and two played it so much. One hundred. I'm glad to see it back. Kingdom Hearts three really hyped for it. It's an awesome game. It's an awesome series, and it's definitely in my top 10 top 10 of all time because kingdom hearts is too dear to me i got too many memories with kingdom hearts fantastic man and i'm sure they'll deliver it's a great game great series play kingdom hearts 1 and 2 if you haven't metro exodus looked great it looks kind of like escape from tarkov graphical wise but so you saw customization uh combat the world's pretty cool i'm sure the game's gonna be good ori and the will of the wisp ori looks Looks interesting. Ori looks interesting. Uh, I don't know what Ori is. Any game. Any games are fun. Give give any games chance, guys. Give any games chance. There's amazing art. You saw the art in the game. It's crazy. It's beautiful. Well done. We just have to play it. You know, play it. Play it. If it's good, if it's really good, people say play it, play it. Give it a chance. Any games, man. Support the indie games. Okay, PUBG, PUBG, PUBG. PUBG for Xbox. Okay. PUBG. Got... Two new announcements. Well, for Xbox 3. Uh, for Xbox, obviously, Sunhook, the new map, coming to summer, 2018. Riot Shield, <laughs> coming to the game. And the winter map, coming to winter. Uh, for PC, obviously, we already, we're already going to get the, the new map as well. But eh, PUBG's PUBG. We know, we, know, we know what it is. Hype trailer, good trailer. But new maps, two new maps, the winter, coming winter. Sunhook, coming summer. And the Shield. Shit looks cool. I'll give it a try. I love PUBG. Got so many hours in PUBG. I'll be playing it. Ha! <laughs> sea of Thieves, welcome back to the world. You're still here? What? You're still here. Sea of Thieves DLC's expansion's finally been announced uh, for July and September, if I was right. Uh, it doesn't tell me right here. But, yes, yeah, Sea of Thieves coming back. Hopefully some story stuff. Hopefully just more content. Content, content, content. That's what we need. Sea of Thieves, if, if this is enough content... Especially the first expansion to really bring people back or, you know, bring people in. It'll be cool. See if these, like, come on. This is the pirate game we all, we always wanted. We just didn't get content. Hopefully, rare. Go through with the content. And, uh, you know, get people back into your game, man. And keep people playing. Keep people playing. So, Chaos Shadows Die Twice from Software's new game. From Software, we know them. We love them. They make great games. I'm sure this game's going to be awesome. It's going to be fun. Combat's gonna be slick, smooth, amazing. Um, no other news for the game. Just gonna have to wait for more. 
Uh, Battlefield 5, Battlefield, Battlefield 5, still Battlefield 5, nothing new with that. Near Automata, Automata is coming to Xbox. Get that game, Xbox players. That is a fantastic game. I have it for my PC, and I hope it runs better than my P than PC because God, that I had to run it with mods because with mods, that game actually ran smoothly. But great game, great story, pretty confusing. Combat's fun, a lot of change in dynamics. Fun game, fun game. Session, Session is a skateboarding game. We thought it was Skate 4. But it is session. Anyways, though, I'm happy. I love skateboarding games, and I don't even skateboard in real life. We're finally getting a skateboarding game. Skateboard games are hype. Skateboard games are fun. The two are so much fun to play with friends. Tales of Vespira, I don't even know what the hell this is. It's to celebrate the 10th anniversary. It's a it's an RPG. I guess it's an RPG. New fully playable characters. I guess if you're a Vespira fan, you're fun. I don't really know what to say about it. Bound Dynamico, great uh great company. Other than that, don't know anything about it. So, Crystal Dynamics, Shadow of the Tomb Raider. First off, before I even speak about the game, and you know I'm not even going to speak about the game too much because I want to speak about more, talk about more. Crystal Dynamics, you guys are amazing over there. You guys are fantastic. Hard workers. Hard freaking workers. You're bringing out these Tomb Raider games like crazy, and they are top quality. Love you guys so much over there, Crystal Dynamics. Fantastic workers, man. Fantastic workers, talented people. Keep up the good work. I can't wait for Shadow of the Tomb Raider to come out because I love your games. Your games are amazing. Keep it up. Don't stop for nobody. And well, we'll be here. We'll be here. We'll buy your game and we're going to love your game because we know 100% you guys are going to come through with a great experience. So Shadow of the Tomb Raider, they came out with just a trailer. A little height, a nice trailer. A nice trailer. And... Well, more Tomb Raider, everybody. We get more Tomb Raider coming in September, one week before my birthday. Hell yeah, I'm excited. Crystal Dynamics, again. You guys support that studio. They're amazing. And finally, when it comes to games, Black Desert's coming to Xbox. If you don't know what Black Desert is, it's an MMO. I have Black Desert online on my PC. It is a great MMO. Um, it's kind of grindy. <laughs> I will say that. It's a grindy MMO. It's a lot about. It's all about grinding, actually. But it's a fun one nonetheless, a great looking game. Hey, Xbox, you get another MMO, so you can finally ditch that one called <clears throat> Elder Scrolls Online. <laughs> and the Xbox One Game Pass. New stuff, new games. Elder Scrolls, Fallout 4, The Division, <laughs> The Fast Start, first cringe of the game. Hey, Times 2, you want to make it go faster? We're going to call it The Fast Start. Eh. Xbox One Game Pass. If you got Game Pass, then I'm sure you're happy. Good job. What else did I miss? I think that is it. The Awesome Adventures of Captain Spirit. Who the hell is that? Oh, the life, the, the life is strange. Okay, now the Life is Strange spinoff. Uh, Captain Spirit. Nice little. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> but we'll have to. It comes free. It'll be free later this June. So if you want a free game, you want to just screw off in the game, these awesome adventures of Captain Spirits will be free later this June. So that is it, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. We just went through all the games. Um, I'm excited for my most excited one. Come on, guys. Where is it? Obviously, Halo. Come on, Halo, guys. Halo. Come on. You got to do this. You got to do this. The Cyberpunk 2077. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you because, oh, my God. You got to do this. You got to do it right. The hype is on you. All right. So everybody, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you after the Bethesda. I'm going to be posting Bethesda's as well. And then PlayStation's as soon as PlayStation is finished. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, especially E3. Good job, Xbox. I applaud you. You did a good job. You did a good job. You surprised me. You surprised me because I thought Xbox was going to be empty. And I own an Xbox. My Xbox is right here. So I'm happy. So good job. I'm proud. Cuphead DLC. Woo! I'll see y'all later.